Oh. And let's not forget, in Rome, it was gloves. That's this right. Might be, I'm assuming, is the first ever car jerk fight of Malatesta. Gonna be interesting. And, um, you know, when Son Cal made his tie fight debut, it was also with Kachuk, and that's also his first time fighting Kachuk, yes. and now it's his second time. So he's got that experience. Now he just needs the experience of being in the winning column. Yeah, it's not easy for Kutch and fighters to adjust to the Kachuk style. Let's see how Son Cal will get on. There you can see Alessio Malatesta, otherwise known as the Smart. 21 years of age from Roma in Italy. He stands at 175 centimeters, and both fighters weighed in yesterday at 71 kgs, the weight limit. He has a professional record of 54 fights with 33 victories, 16 losses, and 5 draws. However, in his amateur career, he has 35 fights with 30 victories. Very impressive. Now, introducing his opponent fighting out of the black corner from Thailand, Son Kao Shah Hapayak. His real name is Tachai Desawong. 30 years of age, 187 meters tall from Roy Et, province in the northeastern part of Thailand. He's had a total of 185 fights, 132 victories, 51 losses and 2 draws. I'm looking forward to see how Son Kao has adapted his style since the last one because in the first round when he fought against Elad, he decided to sort of try to fight in a new style which he wasn't used to. Yeah. He didn't have too much success with that. But then towards the end of the fight, he went back to what he knows, the clinch and knee style, and it seems to have worked out for him. So it's going to be interesting to see what sort of style he brings to the table in the very first round here. Yeah, very intriguing matchup indeed. Gotta say though, this is the matchup we've been waiting for. It is, it is. In the white corner from Italy, Alessio Malatesta. And in the black corner, Son Kao Shaw Hapayak at 71 kilograms. Thailand takes on Italy. So he said that Son Kao is from Roy Et Province. That's right. So was Om Sin. We know that one ended. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see if Zong Kao can do any better. Perhaps they're from two different districts. <laughs> Final prayers and the removal of the Mong Kong, the sacred head gear that's very specific and unique to Muay Thai. Here we go. Round one. We're scheduled three rounds here at Thai Fight. And a huge kick to start things off for Zong Kao. Son Kao fighting on the back foot. Nice left high kick there by Malatesta. Ooh, looking for that left hand. The corner of Alessio is telling him to show that power. Good left hand there by Malatesta. Oh, good elbow as well. Son Kao. Yeah, huge elbow. And then we know one thing for sure. Son Kao can be knocked down. He was knocked down in his previous bout here in Thai fight. Maybe that's something Alessio is trying to do early on. Good kick there from Son Kao. Good right hand there by the Thai fighter. He's got to wake up. As Malatesta took a lead here in this opening round. Good right hand kick there by Son Kao. Yeah, it is a three round fight. You can't afford to go slow in the very first round. You've got to go for it right when the bell rings. Another good body kick there by the Thai. Son Kao, like you said, Kevin, he wants to move in, doesn't he? He wants to clinch. You can see that, but. For some unknown reason, something is stopping him. Maybe he just wants to try to tune up his style, try something new. There's a danger to that though, because to get close and close to Malatesta, who's wearing those car check rope hands with his with his speed. I'm not sure. Could be very but dangerous. That leg of Son Kao could be hurt when Malatesta threw hey, the did, leg kick. Yeah, yeah. He reacted to it. And again he does. Here we go, into the clinch and knee. And right away, we heard his corner saying, no, don't engage in the clinch against Son Kao. Good right hook there by Malatesta again. Knees, and an elbow there by the Thai. And he's straight down the middle. And that caught Malatesta, but Malatesta on his feet immediately. I'm surprised that Malatesta doesn't go back to the low kick soon. It really looked like it caused a problem for him. Good right hand there by Malatesta. On again! That time with the left. You know what? It seemed like he felt the power of Son Kao and decided to start moving back. Maybe, you know, the confidence has drained just a little bit. Good knee here by Son Kao. Exactly where he wants to be. But like I said, to get there, the road is dangerous. Uppercut elbow yeah. that attempted by Malatesta. Yeah. But you can see that Son Kao, I think within the clinch, it's fair to say, it's just a little bit more stronger. And it's that's... Son Kao's trying to fight.
Sokow at a moment where he should be clinching up and defending himself to decide to trade gloves with Malatesta. Got to say, it already showed good spirit. Yeah, I thought Malatesta had his number there, but Sokow, he fought back. And we will see in round two. What a tremendous round one that was, though. Stay with us here at TIE Fight. And here we go, coming into the second round of action is Son Kao Shahapiak in the black corner from Thailand and Alessio Malatesta from Italy in the in, in the white corner. And wow, some shots like Malatesta's low kick seem to have hurt Son Kao. And Son Kao having a lot of success in the clinch and knee game. We'll have to see how the second round goes, but there's the head kick that seemed to have troubled Malatesta for just a second, but I think he just lost his footing. Oh, a clash of heads there as well, but yeah, if you were unaware I thought that the height was unreal. Maybe wrong, yeah. Malatesta looks like he is the real deal. But let's not forget that Malatesta did hurt Son Cao with some punches as well. Maybe Nate, something. And some low kicks. That's right. I would like to see him go back to those. Maybe, Round two. Maybe put a combination together. There's low kicks at hands. Going for the high kick immediately, though, to stop oh. things out. Oh, good. Counter strike there by Malatesta again, going low when Son Cao was trying to go up high. Oh! Good balance there. Good left hand by Malatesta. You gotta love this exchange. Oh, the kick from Son Cao. by Malatesta. And that connected very well. Son Cao though moving forward. But getting hit in the process. And well, the body up to the head there by Malatesta. Malatesta now on the ropes. Clinching up with Son Cao somewhere he doesn't want to be, but in that situation he has to get on the corner we're or get on ropes. We're situated right in the corner of Melatesta's camp here. You can hear him screaming right behind us. Yep. They seem very happy. Oh, he walked into that right high kick there. He took it though, but he's looking hesitant just for a moment. Yeah, Son Cao having a lot of success with that right kick, but Malatesta not exactly fighting back just yet. And another kick for Son Cao. That's four kicks in a row for Son Cao now. Looking for that right hand as well. Oh, good hand here by the Italian. And a good elbow. Malatesta. Son Cao can't keep it inside the clinch. Yeah, Malatesta timed that extremely well. I mean, he saw that right kick coming from Son Cao and decided to go for the combination punch. Good hand to get here by the Italian fighter. His corner screaming at him to move forward. They don't want it to take a step backward. Taking a right hand from Son Cao and a kick straight down the middle. Once again, well done there from Son Cao. So what a fight this is, yeah, Absolutely fantastic. A little back and forth war here at Tag Fight. Both of them exchanging blows. Hard to pick a winner for this one so far. I mean, it's been back and forth. Son Cao edging in with the kicks though, and Malatesta having a lot of success with the hands. I honestly think that there was a case that Malatesta won the opening round. Right hand there by Son Cao. Definitely Defense around the case. here though by Son Cao, in my yes. opinion. Connecting a lot with the right kicks, as I said earlier, and he's going to go back to that again and again and again, but just needs to be wary of those hands from Malatesta. Good right kick there, connected to the body of Malatesta. And a good right hand as well here by the tie. Good uppercut though by Malatesta, and then that hook on the way out. Able to bite off the back foot. Inside kick by Son Cao. Some hesitancy that we didn't see in the opening round. He's now appearing for Malatesta in this second round. But he's able to take Son Cao off his feet that time. Son Cao moving forward. Not much of a guard either. Yeah, he, his hands are extremely low for a fighter who likes to move forward. And for a clinch and knee fighter. Oh, is this some fatigue setting him perhaps from Malatesta? End of round number two. Much better round in my opinion for the tie. Stay with us. Round Here we go, coming into the third and final round. Son Cao in the black corner and Alessio Malatesta in the white. And back and forth action, but this round, got to say it, Son Cao connected with a lot of good roundhouse kicks. Connected very well with Alessio coming back with some punches of his own and he's putting his punches together. He's not just throwing single shots. Yeah, Son Cao, I feel like he's just buoyed by those kicks. Like you said, Kevin, he's starting to put more punches together. Just to make this interesting, he's, Aaron. He's, I feel like he was almost neglecting the clinch. He was like, okay, forget about that. Let's just go fight fire with fire and let's show that I am the stronger of the two. I can sh I can kick and punch. Yeah, he's doing also a great job. The Italian. But Aaron, just to make this interesting, let's give Malatesta the first round and Son Cao the second. Not to make it interesting, I generally believe <laughs> that is the case on my unofficial scorecard. Well, it's been close. It's I think been Malatesta close. took round number one and I think that Son Cao 
edge number two, meaning, like I said, unofficially, if you win this round, you win the fight. So it's going to be a battle out. here in this third round. Sun Kao tuning up the kicks, and he does. He gets it. Nice Good low kick. kick. Yeah. We didn't see that in round number two, did we? We saw a lot of it in round number one. So at the beginning of round number two, but not so much afterwards. A lot of heavy hands from Melatessa, just like we're seeing right now. Good kick from Son Kao. Trouble is, not, not a lot of those hands found their mark. No, they didn't. Son Kao doing a better job covering. Tense moments here. Good you hands see, here by Malatesta again. You can see it right away that not one fighter wants to make a single mistake in this round. It could cost them the entire fight. Good kick to the body by Malatesta. But that elbow from yes. Son Kao connecting right at the end. Good right knee there by Son Kao off the back foot as well. Body shot there from Malatesta. We haven't seen too much of that throughout the fight, but it seems to have put Son Kao on his guard. Big Again, some hesitation. It's one of those things where you know if you make a mistake, you could be in trouble, and you don't want to do that. It starts playing on your brain. It does. It does. And here we go. We're in, into the clinch. Let's see if Son Kao can get the end, and he doesn't. A bit too late there. Yeah, a lot of markings now on the face of Malatesta. I think both of them got some markings yeah, on their faces. Yeah, very true. Big right kick again from Son Kao, and that connected very well. Oh, good left high kick though by Malatesta. Slapping the face on the time, but a beautifully timed right high kick in reply by Son Kao. And that connected oh my as well. Goodness. What a return. Back and forth action here at tight fight, the third and final round. Spinning back elbow attempt just misses the mark by Malatesta, but if you thought he was fatigued, well, he isn't, and there's the proof. Huge right kick again for Son Kao, but a huge left hand and left elbow from Malatesta. I like that combination a lot. Left hand, straight away, the left elbow came out. You're going to love that never die attitude, but Son Kao, he needs to start moving forward. He can't start moving back right now. It's the only point in third round. Oh, good right hand there from Son Kao. And that stopped Malatesta in his tracks. It really did. That will score heavily with the judges, I believe. That was a clean strike there by Son Kao. And without a shadow of a doubt, I mean, that surprised Malatesta. Malatesta doesn't want to feel that right hand again. Another right hand from Son Kao. But a good right hook at the same time by Malatesta. How in the world do you score this right, Aaron? How sure. do you score this? I don't know. Dare probably... I say, fourth extension round. It could happen because there's no draws on tie fight. So even. All right, well, like I said, me and Kevin are not the judges. Thankfully, we will go to the judges' scorecards again here. Tie fight. But, wow, what a great fight that was between two Muay Thai warriors. Remember, Malatesta went up in weight to fight Song Kao. Flew all the way from Italy after his success against Sanchai to fight someone who's the complete opposite style of yeah. Sanchai. Sanchai uses his footwork, he moves away from the danger. A very technical fight. Very technical. Song Kao's like a bulldozer. Clinch and knee moving forward, but we didn't see so much clinch and knee from him. He went more for the right roundhouse kick, which connected quite a lot. He did. I was also impressed with his hands as well. We didn't see a lot of that in the last fight. It's like you said, he really wanted to clinch against Elad, but this time Son Kao, maybe he's improved his technique with regards to the punching. I think it paid dividends, but is it enough to win the fight? We're about to find out. Let's get the official confirmation of the result. I mean, how tiring would it be for these two if it went to a draw and they had to do an extra fourth round? Well, some of us are a drawing round. That was an extension round. All right. So maybe <laughs> it could happen. We'll just give the draw. Anyway, here we go. จากกันนับกันนะดูว่าจะลุยต่อไหมยกสี่หรือว่าใครจะเข้าวินเป็นผู้ชนะกันนะมาครับเขาหรือดำดีครับเด็กครั้งนี้เขาหรือดำดีเ